Hello my friends, been working out in the shop here the last couple weeks. I uh, haven't had much time for videos, but I had time for everything else. So I've been working on the legs here, as you can see, got the up to the waist pretty much built, working on the joints and the cylinders. Over here, I got one set up. Same thing, just I got the pneumatic cylinder on it. You can see the end of the cylinder. Basically, you cycle the thing, you can move the joint. Cycle it back, wiggle the joint, it locks again. That's how that stuff works for all of them. Figured you get a kick out of seeing that. Over here. Basically took a lot of the pieces off this thing to measure up uh, parts and pieces since I'm duplicating most of this for the new build. Uh, strip the inside out and kind of see some of the uh, structure basically. Uh, eighth inch by one steel, as light as I could possibly make it and still hold together, basically, because steel is heavy. Over here I got the new piece, still coming together, just got the rough build in. Basically you want it on there. Legs will be bolted up here somehow when I'm done fooling around with the joints. But that's as far as I got with that. Uh, for next week, I picked up a miniature camcorder with a mic. I'm gonna try to make a proper video. I've been working with the ClipChamp software, so I made a little progress with that, enough to do the basics at least. So we'll give that a shot next week. Uh, next up, something that's kind of a big deal to me, the Hacksmith is building a Fallout Power Armor suit. Let me repeat, the Hacksmith is building a Fallout Power Armor suit. I am pretty pumped on this. I'm looking forward to see a well-funded build, what it ends up uh, looking like. So I'm pretty pumped on that. Uh, next weekend, I'll have four days off, so I'll be getting quite a bit more done. And I'm going to try to do the first uh, tutorial video, so look forward to that. Add Victoria, my friends.